Well, it wasn't that long ago that we introduced you all, uh, Valley Spotlight, to Becca. And Becca was this wonderful artist who, she and her daughter Willow were making these, um, you know, art projects and these special messages for people when they were in assisted living during COVID. And we've kept up with her and she's just like this wonderful lady. And I follow you on social media. We are friends and we are. I just like when I see certain things like pop up, I'm thinking to myself, I cannot wait to tell the whole world about stuff. And this is one of those things for like, I don't know, like a million reasons in my own world, but Becca, congratulations Thank you. on Lucky Gypsy. Thank you. This is the name Thank of you. your new company. Yes. And uh, it started sort of, you know, well, probably started like a long time ago when you were like a kid <laughs> and learning to be who you were. But yeah. the, the bags and the art that comes along with it, we'll yep. get to all that and tell you what the process is. but. Tell everybody at home and people that are, you know, seeing you for the first time in this way, what this is all about. Well, okay, so thank you, Laura. You're it's welcome. always a pleasure. So Lucky Gypsy, I guess um, for me, well, we can rewind kind of quickly. You know, I went to college for, I went to undergrad for uh, fine arts. Mm -hmm. um, I went to graduate school for my MFA at right. Pratt Institute in New York City. Big deal. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's kind deal. of a big That's deal. That's a big deal. It, it was. Thank you. Thank You're you. Welcome. It was a big deal. Um, although halfway through, I switched my major to art business. That's okay. Uh, yeah, it yeah, kind of fell out. I fell out of of making art, making you know, being creative, and life happens. Right, and you're a mom, and exactly. like moving and changing yeah. careers, and then COVID happens. And yeah. Have so fast forward a lot of years, All COVID happened. Time at home. Yeah. So yeah, you, you find yourself with a lot of extra time at home, um, a lot of extra time to get inside your head, or clean your house, or do projects, or clean your you know, house and clean your closets, clean everything. <laughs> um, so. I thought to myself, you know, I need, I feel like I need to grow. I need to bring back some creativity in my life. So I, you know, took it upon myself to every night give myself like an art lesson. So I'd go online, I'd draw, I'd sketch, I'd just write in my journal a little bit. Simple stuff. And Not all this all no, at once. No, no. Okay. And this is for me, like, like the kind of art that I was used to doing was more uh, sculpture or I guess in college, the major that I had was new forms. So I did a lot of like conceptual, um, Insulation pieces, not not something that's this is functional. Like functional art. Yeah, this is not what I did in college. No, it, it, it is. But not. this is fun, right? But it is absolutely fun. Yeah. You, you. So I just started. I said, you know what? I think it would be really fun to like paint on on bags. But I'm not really that good of a painter, so it's kind. I just saw it. <laughs> Can we just go so through it's all of kind of examples? it's actually funny though like no I I got that like if I showed you the paintings that I did in college they were so bad I got C's in painting like I was not good at painting but I'm good with colors and textures and so I bought some bags at a couple different you know yeah secondhand stores um, and just started layering colors and playing with them and I really like yeah I feel like I think I have something and actually we're where is my the, the, the very first one? Yeah. Oh, the very first one. Oh, no, that, the blue uh, one. Oh, that I'm that I that the one that, that you've that, claimed. That, that I've claimed the very first one. Yes, I did. Yeah. I did do that today. So this was yeah, you did. It's yours. But yes, yeah, so this was this was my first one. And you name them. I do. Well, because they're like a work of art for you. <sighs> okay. So so yes, I yes and no. I name them, but some of them don't have names, and I feel really sorry for the ones that don't have <laughs> names. Like I won't send them out with out a name. So this one, it reminded me, the colors in it, I love the blue. It reminded me of um, Monet's Water Lily, so I named this one Water Lily. So yeah, this was my first one, and this one did have a name. Don't so so I'm actually doing a partnership with Grey Boutique and Boardman. And I'm really on our I, show, so hi ladies. I'm very excited about that, and um, I guess the, at, we might have stuff in the store a little earlier, but I know for sure that November 11th is their Christmas open house, and we will have the full line available there. Um, I have goals to have, you know, a customizable website where I'll be doing custom pieces and, you know, pick your colors. Yeah, pick your yeah, occasion. but it's it takes a, it's a, I mean, it's a work in progress. There's a lot that goes into it. Yes, so, it you know, my Instagram is is live, but getting ready to be booming what with is content. The Instagram my, before we have to say goodbye yes, and good no, luck, even though we're gonna and like the painting, like to have the interactiveness with the kids and everything. Yes. I just am so, so grateful. my Instagram is at Lucky Gypsy underscore Rescue Bags. Um, 
there's easy to find, you know. Yeah. Um, so if you follow, then I'll have news, you know, different items that you can purchase. And also if you follow Gray Boutique, uh, it's at Gray Fashion Boutique. Mm -hmm. um, they're gonna have some release dates and everything. So I'm excited to be working with them. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Steve's gonna love that jacket she's working on. I know that. I know, I know. That. I'm so, excited about that too. Couldn't be prouder of you. Beautiful stuff. Lucky Gypsy. These bags are very lucky that they're no longer Yeah, they're, they're rescue bags because they're no longer sitting in right. the store waiting to be thrown in the trash. They're getting a new lease on life. And mm. if, we all know that they have lots of stories. To if tell. bags could tell, holy moly. Holy moly, yep. I would want to lock all my bags in the closet yeah. and never let it out ever again. <laughs> no, exactly. <laughs> thank you, Becca. Oh, thank Congratulations. you. Congratulations. Thank you so and much. Good luck. We can't wait to see what else you're going to do. Okay? Stay tuned. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome.